Hello everyone and welcome back to Jacklet Educational Channel. So this is the time for the environmental science quiz which we conduct every week on Monday on this platform. Yes, this quiz is to prepare ourselves for the NET, GATE or any other entrance examinations related to environmental science and to know something about our environment. So those who are new you should know these are the rules for the quiz contest and one must read all these rules before proceeding for the quiz. And the best thing about this quiz is you can be one of the top performer for the month and can win cash prizes along with the certificates. So if you want to win, participate more and answer more questions correctly. So without wasting much time, let's get started. The first question is under the Rhino relocation project during 1987, the rhinos were introduced in which of the following places? So I'll wait for certain seconds then I will go for the next question. The second question is the reed swamp stage is also referred to as what? So read every option carefully. Let's move to the third question. The third question is alpha diversity refers to the diversity within a particular area or ecosystem and is usually expressed by what? Time is running out. Let's move to the next question. The next question is a majority of the antibiotics are derived from actinomycetes which comes from the members of which of the following genus? Let's move to the next question. The next question is which one of the following is the micro symbiont in the Azola anabina symbiosis? So this symbiosis is very important, Azola anabina and you have to tell which is the micro symbiont. The sixth question is which group of following factors determine the discharge of a stream? So I will request you to write all the options in a paper so that it will be easier for you to write in the comment section when the quiz is over. The seventh question is the giant volcano craters are known as what and the options are vent, fault, fissure or caldera. Let's move to the next question. Then the next question is the severe drought is declared if so read every option carefully. Let's move to our ninth question. The ninth question is it is air pollutant which is mostly emitted by the diesel driven vehicles but not from the petrol driven is what? So we are moving towards the final question of this quiz contest. And the final question is if the EIA that is environmental impact assessment indicates that another state is likely to be affected, the state in which environmental impact assessment is planned has to do what? So here we come to the end of this quiz contest. Hurry up guys and write all the options in the comment section. And stay tuned for the results part which will be uploaded tomorrow. See you guys in our next video.